A lot of great information coming down the pike. You've got some really exciting news coming out on some of the new technology that you've unveiled here today. Tell me a little bit about the new design of the engine and the system that you're bringing to uh, Oshkosh. Yeah, so we have designed this uh, a system that is a thermal hybrid powertrain that is patented now in 62 countries, including the United States, both for helicopters and also for obviously aircrafts. And what we want to bring today to the United States is a technology that can be applicable to LSA aircraft, for kits aircraft, for drones, everything that is in a non-certifiable environment that it should be available very soon. And my understanding, you said it was already patented in 60 countries and if, if I put this on my aircraft, it's already certified, right? So, as I said, you don't need to certify it because if you are in LSA or if you are in drones, you don't need a full certification, okay? But you got a very solid engine from Kawasaki four-cylinder, very powerful. Uh, it's 200 horsepower. And then you got an electric motor from Safran, which is also, uh, this one has been certified anyway. And that one is 60 kilowatt. And the combination, 60 kilowatt is on, uh, 80 horsepower. So you got 280 horsepower to give you what we call the push to perform. These engines can run out of half gas, but they also can be running out of unleaded gasoline because they come from the automotive world. So we have that flexibility, but with Kawasaki, we're also developing technologies that we will be able to put in our Casio aircraft behind us mm -hmm. that will be uh, capable of hydrogen. It will be liquid hydrogen, but it will be direct combustion into the, into the engine. Obviously, when it gets to the engine, it's gaseous, obviously, but the storage will be liquid.